Welcome to Mornings with Mark. The scripture I'm looking at this morning is Psalm 145. I'll read verses 8 and 9. They're the, it's the text for this upcoming Sunday. The Lord is gracious and merciful, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love. The Lord is good to all, and his compassion is over all that he has made. Ah. <sighs> These are words worth taking a deep breath over. They've been ones that have been resounding within my spirit over the last couple of weeks, really. They keep coming to mind. And today, as I've been meditating on them, it's been a word from God about God's um, attitude toward me and the attitude God is calling me to emulate in my relationships with others. So what good news it is that with regard to me, the Lord is gracious and merciful, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love. And how important that I recognize this is the model, the example for me to follow. That I would be gracious and merciful, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love, that I would be good to all, that my compassion would be over all that God has made. Now, that's our call, to be witnesses to God's love in this world. I think about in our world right now how often we see people just rising up in anger, in resentment, uh, how we're pointing fingers at one another, and certainly we need to be honest about our own sin, uh, make amends for the ways we've hurt people, but we need to be practicing this, and I'm not, just talk I'm not talking about those people over there, over there, I'm talking about me about you if you're interested in joining me, that we would be, I would be, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love, that we would be gracious and merciful, whatever anybody else might do, that we might follow the example of our loving God. Would you pray with me? Gracious God, we thank you that you are slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love, that you are compassionate and good to all that you've made. We pray a word of thanks that you love us, that you are patient and kind with us. And God, we pray that indeed we would be witnesses to you, ambassadors for your kingdom that we would extend your love and compassion to the world around us. We pray in Jesus' name, who revealed your love more powerfully than could be imagined. In his name we pray, amen. God bless you.